how to list products in your Agridot Market store. This process is quite simple and intuitive, but if you think you need help, you can watch this video. We will show you how to list products in your Agridot Market store, step by step. You can follow these instructions whenever you need support. First, log in. Once you have received the confirmation email that your Stripe account has been approved, you can log in from the link received in the email and in the future with the login button at the top right of the platform. Enter your email address and password, then press the login button. Your seller account will open on the Agridot Market platform with the information you have declared. To avoid errors in the calculation of invoices, check that the percentage of sales tax, GST, or VAT you have to pay is correct. If it is not correct, click on the pencil symbol and change the sales tax, GST, or VAT rate you need to invoice. Then click Save. In the My Store area, you will find in the first row the link to your store that you should save, and after listing your products, distribute it all to your customers on social networks, on Facebook, Twitter, on business cards, in emails, etc. Anyone who accesses this link will be able to see the products listed in your store. See our samples farm, agra.market slash farm slash US1. Also, here you will notice that at this moment, your seller account on the agra.market platform is a free account, and the commission of the platform that applies to your sales is 12%. If you are an occasional merchant of agricultural products and you sell less than US $250 a year, you don't have to do anything. But if you are a genuine farmer or a merchant of agricultural products, you should upgrade to the Business or Business Plus package to benefit from a lower sales commission of only 4%. Click the Free button to upgrade membership. Here, you will find professional packages. The Business package gives you the opportunity to list products in two different locations and a sales commission of only 4% with an annual subscription of $30. US the Business Plus package, recommended for agricultural, cooperative and associations, gives you the opportunity to list products in an unlimited number of locations and a sales commission of only 4% with an annual subscription of US $100. If you have decided which package suits you, click the Upgrade button. If you have a promotional coupon, check the I have a coupon code box, enter the coupon code and click the Continue button. If you do not have a promotional coupon, click Continue. If you used a valid promo code, the payment for your subscription will be reduced as a percentage of the coupon discount, and the payment form will only calculate your difference. Fill in the payment form with your card details and click on the Pay button. After making the payment, you will be redirected to the subscription page, where you will see that your membership has changed from Free to Business, or Business Plus, depending on the chosen package. You will see the same update in your member account. Your membership has changed from free to business. In order to be able to list products, you must first establish your points of sale. In the upper right corner, next to the shopping cart, you will see the menu of your account. Click on My Farms. Click the Add Farm button. In the first field, write the name of the farm. Only you will see this name. It is for your reference. The other information will be written on the invoice so that your customers know where to pick up their orders. This information must be real and correct. After you have filled in all the information, click the Save button. The first sales location has been added. If you want to add other sales locations, do the same as for the first location. If you delete a farm, all products listed on that farm will be deleted. Product Listing Enter your account menu and click on My Listings. Click on the Add Product Stock button. Select a product category, for example, fruits. Then select a subcategory, for example, apples. Select the quality of the product stock. See Quality Standards. If there are several qualities for the same product, you should list several stocks. For example, one stock of apples for extra quality and another stock of apples for Class 2 quality. If your customers are dissatisfied with the quality of your products, you will receive negative reviews and your seller account will be affected. Respect your customers and you will be respected. The higher your rating, the more customers will trust you. 
select the variety of product, if applicable. Select the appropriate unit of measurement in which to sell this stock of products. In the quantity field, enter the quantity available for this product stock, and then select the point of sale where this product stock is located. Don't forget, if you sell products outside the Agri.Market Market platform, you should periodically update your stock on the platform so that you don't end up with paid orders that you can't deliver. In the additional product description field, write any other specifications that may be relevant to the buyer if necessary. For some products, such as cereals, it is necessary to write certain details that are not found in our form, such as moisture, fat, etc. Once you have put the information about this product stock, you need to determine how you want to sell. There are three options, wholesale, pickup, or with home delivery. You can select one or all three options. If you selected the wholesale sales type, enter the net price per product unit. The form will automatically calculate and show you the price with all taxes that the buyer will see on the platform and will pay. Agri.Market Market Platform Commission, Stripe Commission for Card Payment Processing, the estimated amount you will get per unit of measure after deducting the Agri.Market Market and Stripe Commissions. There is a small difference due to Stripe's fixed fee, which differs from one type of card to another and applies to every transaction. See Fees page. Furthermore, you need to set the minimum ordered quantity for a wholesale order so that the price is competitive and select from the list how to pack the product. International buyers will want to know if you can provide export documents, customs declarations, quality certificates, etc. If you are able to provide such documents, check the box, we can provide export documents. Importers are interested in full services. Remember, for wholesale sales, the buyer has the obligation to pick up the order from seller point of sale. He should communicate information about the vehicle that will come for loading. And the seller has the obligation to load the order in vehicle. If you want to sell pickup from your farm or store, you will have to check the box, I want to sell retail pickup. And in the same way, you will write the net price and the platform will calculate and show you the gross price, the sale price, all the costs of the commissions, as well as how much you will get after deducting the commissions. You must also set the minimum ordered quantity for a pickup order so that the price is competitive and select from the list how to pack the product. For pickup sales, the buyer has the obligation to pick up the order from the seller's point of sale. If you want to sell with home delivery, you will have to check the box, I want to sell retail home delivery. In the same way, you will write the net price and the platform will calculate and show you the gross price, the sale price, all costs with commissions, as well as how much you will get after deducting commissions. You must also set the minimum ordered quantity for a home delivery order so that the price is competitive and covers shipping costs. You must select how the product is packaged from the list. Furthermore, you need to specify the delivery distance from your farm. It can be the distance to the nearest locality and select the unit of measurement for distance, miles or kilometers. Check the days of the week when you make the home deliveries so that the buyer knows on which days you make deliveries. An order is delivered on the next delivery day since an order was paid. For home delivery sales, the seller has the obligation to transport the order to the buyer's address, up to the main entrance to the building, or the residential complex in order to avoid problems with the lack of parking spaces. If you make several deliveries, you can call the next buyer to tell him that you will arrive shortly and he will be waiting for you at the entrance to the residential complex. Set the details on the phone. You have the buyer's phone number in the order details or in the invoice. After entering the required data for each type of sale, check the box that you agree to the terms and conditions and save. Your stock for this product has been added to your list and is now visible to buyers in both the product exchange at home delivery searches, at pickup searches, at wholesale searches, the buyer will see with prices in other currencies.
as well as in your store. Wholesale. Pick up. Home delivery. Do the same for adding all your product stocks. Don't forget to make the Agri.Market Market Store known to everyone in your area, both through social networks, through emails sent to customers, but especially by displaying the Agri.Market Market logo at your store or farm on clothing or vehicles. People need to know about your farm store. Use Agri.Market Market logos. The results will appear soon.